Okay, I'm out here and meeting like eight, eight people. And what we're trying to figure out why we she just don't about this. Because we parked in the parking lot. What was the name of the building? What was the name of the building? What was the name of the building? So, day two officially, and we are trying to find a boat to ride. Uh, the original boat we booked, well, the engine doesn't start. And he was rude about it. You know, we paid like, what, $30, $40 for parking. So we're like, well, at least can you compensate the parking? This dude was like, do you know how much an engine's gonna cost? Two hours out here in the sun. Now we have to figure out what we're gonna do. the business you know what I'm saying like you inconvenienced us we could have been on get could have been on any other yacht today we chose your yacht and that's how you represent your business by getting upset at us because we're asking for you to accommodate our parking at the time we thought it was gonna be nearly 36 40 dollars and he was like nah if you see that's the issue that's why your engine broke down because you're cheap you're cheap you can't start a business if you're gonna be cheap invest in your business take care what you need to take care of I'm on YouTube this is my dad you, you know my dad Oh, do I know your dad? Do I know you? <laughs> what up, man? Dan and Hall! Wait, Dan and Hall! <laughs> yeah. That's not what you're supposed to say. Dan and Hall! Alright. So basically, the platform is about to open up later on this year, but there was a beta that was open. They closed the beta. They're about to open up the beta again, I think, next week or the week after that. Sure. You gotta see that this I'm about to see it in this quarter. After about an hour, went home, changed, we get to South Beach. Takes us an hour to find parking. Unbelievable. Hey. I need to live a life like that. So right now, we're on the Ocean Drive. And uh, right now it's pretty much shut down because I'm assuming COVID, a lot of restaurants are eating on the actual street. So, uh, yeah, it's pretty chill. I'm with all the vibes. <laughs> like Pop Smoke said, bitch, I'm a thought, get me lit, but I'm not a thought. <laughs> but you can get me lit, okay? <laughs> all right, so it's about to get a little congested up. I had to put on my mask. Just can't take no chances, man. Can't take no chances. <laughs> Trust me, that was very, very uncomfortable just now. So we're off, off of um, 
Ocean Drive. Then we're on college right now. We just heard that there's a curfew, so we got down here and uh, we're gonna be headed headed back soon. So everything is closed. Yeah, you too. Yeah. <laughs> The mandatory curfew in the entertainment district put into effect at 8 Saturday night. This is what... Today, day... I don't know what day it is. Oh. It is, damn, what day is it? Guys, good morning. Crazy night last night. Miami is now viral right now for not so good reasons. Everyone's kind of just waking up. It's like almost noon. Even me, I woke up late. I always wake up early, just getting up, tired. But you know what, today, I think it's actually gonna be a good day. We actually might get on a jet ski. We'll see. As you know the challenge we had yesterday, we tried to get on the boat, boat didn't work out. We tried every boat in town. We tried the jet skis, didn't work out. So I'm looking for the garbage. This is where I've been in two days. I don't know where it's at. Oh, see it. Uh, right now, we're in a town called Hollywood. Our goal right now is to try to get everyone up so that we can make it to the jet skis at one. So this morning, had a very, very powerful conversation with a guy I met here. He's you know, been to jail, whatever, did his time, came out. And, uh, woo, that shit, quad exhaust? The Suburbans are like that, I didn't even. This motherfucker plush, bro. Woo wee. Like a vet. Oh. It's like a sprinter. <laughs> Bro, this is fast. Yeah, I heard that, I hear that exhaust. Ooh. 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 What is this? What is it? You hide everything. So listen, anybody, anybody watching this, you know what I'm saying? You going through something and you think you can't do it, this man is a testament that you can do anything you want to do, for real. 15 years behind the wall. Yeah. 15 years and came out, this man came owns a tow nothing. truck. Tow truck company, man, doing good. You see, yep. <laughs> doing good. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? He's I mean, he's still working, and that's another lesson. I'm on right? vacation. I'm still working. <laughs> <laughs> For real, like you can do it. Even came out broke. Yeah, see, broke. Yeah. <laughs> I love that I motivate people because some people, don't, some people think, oh, this thing came out here. Facts. Shit. You know what I mean? This shit was hard. Yeah. No. It, <laughs> you know, it was hard. It wasn't easy. I don't want to go back to prison. Yeah, nah, not at all. But the main thing is, like, you persevered, bro. Yeah, you man. like, you knew you had a vision. They got this people that been out here and ain't doing shit. <laughs> how could you be out here complaining? How, man? Tell you I admire that, man. man yeah, I for real, for you, real. Man. Thank you for Good that. Nah, for you, real. Welcome to Green TV. Yeah, what it be like? Nah, we gotta see what's what going on. Like? Is it still in the store? Okay. We still got stuff in the Ooh. oven. We still got it popping here. Oh, We're trying to get that. the bacon going. We got some potatoes, oh, some sauce. So, damn, let me bump my shirt up a little bit. So yes, 
I am dressed now. It is extremely bright out here. My cousins are married. So you did brought the white jeans out today. You seen the white jeans? So we just kind of doing a little brunch. I think the anniversary is either today or this weekend. So we decided to you know throw something, do something nice for them. Four minutes my uh, cousin's gonna be here again this is the anniversary so we were throwing a brunch for them uh, but that's what you gotta do as a family man you not only embrace your immediate family but you also gotta love and embrace the people who they decide to um, you know, marry and, and start their own family with so in just a moment they're gonna be here so we're excited we're getting ready Everything on South Beach as far as jet skis was booked today. So we found a place on um, Sunset Boulevard. Gentleman Rush. Like riding a motorcycle. I haven't done what you did <laughs> since I was like yeah. nine years old. <laughs> do what I do. I live off life. <laughs> See? <And> then, you <laughs> know, she says she needs some fun. Yes. I'm that's not all. telling you. <laughs> Just, you know what? Hey, we do Woosa. Pull the air. Woosa. There you go. I just got off of this and I flipped. And, it, and the funny thing is, my first time riding a jet ski. The thing about this is, we was flying. These things go really fast. So my sister and I we was riding on it together. It's all about balance and weight. You know, in the beginning I was blowing. Like, I was killing it. But after a while, my sister was like, slow down. Like she didn't want to go too fast. I was, we was kind of just you know, cruising. Somebody blew by us and waved. Because we weren't going that fast. Like we toppled over and, you know. But it was all fun. We, nobody got hurt. I'm okay. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> we're we're back. I'm wet. Yes. I'm wet too. <laughs> and I ripped my pants. Yeah, yeah, I know. We 
But you know what? The biggest thing is we're safe, man. Because somebody else flipped and uh, they actually took the ski with them. And, you know, that's, that's worse. So we actually knew when I was here, the dirt bikes. We knew that when you flip, just let it go. Fort Lauderdale Jet Skis, 954-687-3383. Yeah, fuck with us, yeah. Chico. Fuck with us, your boy Chico, tour guide all day. <laughs>